Caught in the Act on Fox 10 is sponsored by Hunter Security. Your security is our business. According to the Federal Trade Commission, of the 3 million identity theft and fraud reports received in 2018, 1.4 million were fraud related and 25% of those cases reported money was lost. Last year, consumers reported losing about 1.48 billion related to fraud complaints, an increase of 406 million from 2017. Every little bit adds up and tonight, Adding to this year's total, a couple mobile police hope someone will recognize. It's tonight's Caught in the Act. They may have looked unassuming, a man and woman withdrawing money out of the ATM at Gulf Coast Federal Credit Union. Only problem is it wasn't their cards or their money. According to investigators, the couple were using cloned cards, each victim reporting a loss between $500 to $900, a huge hit to anyone's pocketbook. According to Mobile Police, the victim's cards were from various banks across the city. Must be nice to spend other people's hard-earned money. To protect yourself, investigators suggest checking your bank accounts daily. If you see any suspicious activity, call your bank immediately. Immediately. And if it's fraud, file a police report. Again, take a real good look. Do you know who these two are? If you do, turn them in to Mobile Police. Meanwhile, if you have video of someone caught in the act, email it to us at fox10reported at fox10tv.com. We might just show it in our newscast.